Godot 4.3 is out and it's a big deal for 2D game devs because, check this out, you can finally use nodes to represent tilemap layers. This makes the workflow much more in line with Godot 3's but with all the level editing power of the new tilemap system. Of course, in addition to selecting individual nodes in the scene doc, you still have shortcut buttons in the editor to quickly cycle between layer nodes or to select them all. Nice, right on time for the upcoming tilemap module in our 2D course. If you're new to Godot, here's some background on what went down. When Godot 4 was first released, the brand new tilemap system gave users a complete level editing tool. It was a powerful new addition, but a big departure from the logic of the old tilemap system. In 4.2, we got the ability to mirror and rotate tiles, but many users still mourned the old system's use of individual nodes to represent layers. Enter Godot 4.3 with the best of both worlds. Time to try it out and churn out some brand new levels. Check out new features in Godot 4.3 by clicking right here and follow us to not miss any.